selected in-game saves to afterplay and I'm going to show you how they work. Uh, this is good because in-game saves can generally be more reliable than than save states. So now in afterplay, whenever you, you save the game, uh, we will we will take we will take it and we'll store it for you. And you'll get a, a confirmation in the bottom right hand corner of the screen uh, when it's been saved. So as you can see here, you get your confirmation that it's saved, and you can access them in under saves and under SRAMs. And if you want to load a particular SRAM, you can just click play. It restarts the emulator, and you're you're loaded up from from that point with that SRAM saved or with that that SRAM loaded. And if you want to use uh, in-game saves exclusively for a game, you can just go to game and turn off auto load state. Now, uh, the the game will still save your, your states automatically and you can still use manual saves. They just won't be automatically loaded when you start the game. So this can give you maybe a more authentic experience. So now if I exit this and when I open it, my, my latest... Uh, in-game save will be loaded and uh, I can continue from there so that's how it works and I hope you you enjoy it